are you doing here? <laughs> Welcome back to God of War. I feel like we start and end a lot of episodes right here. I'm not exactly sure why. I guess it's like the central area of the map, but we're here again. Um, and it's been a minute. I can't lie. And um, we got to get this head alive again, which under normal circumstances would not be possible. But this is God of War, so we're going to do it. I'm also playing on a PS5 controller now. So look at that. Look at the triangle button and stuff. Oh, so so different. So fancy. We have 6k XP to spend. I think I want to spend it. Can I... Is there anything to upgrade with the wolf? Oh my god. The level 3 is a lot of XP. The falcon's dive. Which honestly, it doesn't look that good. So I don't think I want to upgrade it. Obviously can't upgrade the shield. I love this attack. But it only adds one more frost. So like I want to get the good a good value out of it. Pressing uh, trigger or R1 performs a slam follow-up. That could be cool. You know what? Let's, let's give the bear a try. It's pretty cheap anyway. And for heavy, I do want to have a ranged one to make up for the other one being very close up. Do we go back to this for a minute or we keep the shards? I think stat-wise, six total. Knives is better, so we'll keep knives. Uh, and skills... To be honest, I kind of feel done upgrading shield until I have nothing else to spend on because, like, I don't really use shield very much. This is cool, but that's 4,000 XP. Well, barehanded, aim and press R1. Or we have this. I like that. Oh, and I can get the follow up. Okay, let me try to do it. Nice. Okay, and then we got the arrows. It's coming back, it's coming back. Alright, well let's get heading not this way. Um, get into the boat. Do you remember the way back to the witch from here? That way, behind the big statue of Thor. Ah, yes. I remembered. Exactly. I was just testing you to see if you knew. Because I did. For sure. It hasn't been a month since the last recording session. I lied. I mean, I will say, the graphics in this game are fantastic, but the water, the water does look a little suspect, I can't lie. Maybe I've been playing too much Sea of Thieves, where the water is just incredible for some reason, but uh, kind of looks like we're swimming in, in plastic. Here we are. You want to dock here? Where else, Atreus? This is not the house. Huh? The water dropped. And the serpent rose. Right. I knew that. Oh, yeah, I knew that too. Of course, and we both knew, really, because we're just geniuses. <clears throat> I hope I don't have to... Do I have to touch those to activate them? No, I don't. Okay. I know she's really powerful, but do you really think the witch can bring a head back to us? She seems competent in her craft, and we have nothing to lose. If she can't bring it back to life... Can we keep the head? No. <laughs> but you may feed it to the fish. Oh, God. Okay. Ow. Huh? Don't get fucked. Yeah. What? Fuck you. <laughs> gotcha, bitch. Yeah. Hey, that's my job. Ow. Nice. White bear. <laughs> Hi. Oh. Well, I was going to do that, but good job. The house appears to not be enterable. Oh, the turtle is standing. That's right. She lives in a turtle. It's a little weird, but I guess we've seen Stranger in this game. Shit. I need sap. I saw you. Is there anything over here? There was. I bet this will lead out. Oh, is this the chest that gives us the piece we needed? 
This does more than decipher those Nuspelheim runes. It also contains the travel room. We can go to should a new go realm. To the fire realm. Oh, we so should. I don't know if we're ready for it though. Like, like what level are you gonna be? Is it like a side option? I don't know. Excuse me. I need my treasure. Because that's mine. Oops. I'll be having that. Some steel. Savartelheim? Surely that was pretty close. Hexil. I'm gonna try to be uh, a bit more consistent with the, the God of War. For now on. Just had a lot of stuff I was doing outside of the YouTubing. So plus these take a lot oh these take a long time to edit. La -da -da -da. Because I try. I try to make them high quality for you guys. Here. Boy. Oh. A scroll. It's another one of those maps. That is it. Or oh, don't show me. That's fine. I, I didn't care. <laughs> There it is. Uh, no? Damn you. This one. The turtle's tribute. Where the leaves are red, the boss is green. I buried the treasure where the tortoise doth of dream. It's under the tortoise head. Fuck you! No! Yes! Get her! Oh! I've never done that! That was so cool! Oh, I don't have to bury it? Oh, no, I do. Okay. Wait for it. Wait for it. Come here! Yeah. Jerk. What are you? Mom called it Hell's Bramble. Can't burn it, can't cut it. Can't burn it, can't cut it. Can you hey, eat it? I think I see another one of those bowls of sand up there. That I drew the runes into? Not sure how we reach it. Father. Nice. Whoa. Get up here. No. Get you now. Give him this. Okay, well, that's way too far to jump. I'm not sure why this was a thing. This will be fun. To begin with, but uh, convenience. Uh, I can't go. jump over with those wooden boards in the way. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Good cry, baby. There you go. It is. It's another one of those sand bowls. Hey, you said that already. There are different rooms along the There's another one over there. Hello. <laughs> Boy. Over here. Yes, sir. What do you yeah. say, though? Okay. Huh? A golden oh. chair. <clears throat> uh, <clears throat> A golden chest. What have you? Ooh. Swarm of crows. Oh hell yeah! I want to use it, but I also I have such a like a I don't know what you call it, but I like I need it to be upgraded before I feel it it can be used. But I don't I don't need to upgrade it. I just use it. It only makes it a little better, but still, it would be nice. In the chest of goodies. God damn it. These just make me angry. I don't know why. I'm just angry. Just angry. Just angry. Just angry. I assume this is the way out. It's, it's the only thing I can climb. So climb we shall. Turn back, Aesir. Guess the gods are welcome here. Well, that's an agreeable statement. <gasps> there he is. I hope he remembers us. It's the Turbal. Should we name him? How about Turbal? That was stupid. Alright. Give that a shoot. Give Boy. that a read. This place is Hold pretty on. cool. Let me read this. Yeah, I that's what I wanted you to do. Thanks. 
really like that you don't say anything about it. You just kind of write it down and keep How's to yourself. How's it going, Charlie? Is your witch friend here? What yeah. is that name? That's what he told me it was. What it sounded like in my head anyway. Charlie. I like Turbo more, personally. Where was that treasure? Oh, what the? Can you not do that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ow. Go bros! Birds! Bird bros. Oh wait, let me try the new combo. Shit, shit, shit. Dang it. Yeah. Nailed it, first try. You gotta wait pretty long for it to go though. Alright, from the picture it was like right here, wasn't it? Is it wh where he sleeps? Is it? Oh. Aha! Ooh, Oblivion Stone. Upgrade pommels. Okay. And. An enchantment that increases frost damage. That'll be good for my. Ooh, that's a good bit of hack silver and steep. Pretty Another good. One of those sandals. Read it. What does it say? Falcon, hawk, and turtle dove. Swim aloft in oceans above. Do these help? Those runes on the rock. They don't spell anything. It's gibberish. Everything you say is gibberish, so it wouldn't be far off. How about this? Can you read it? Sir. <laughs> Made their new themes upon all who trust them. What does it say? Yes, sir. Death to the Raven God, Lord of the Hang. Okay. Death, uh, death to any gods. I'm sure I we'll find assume. the answer around here somewhere. To what? To, to that? Bring it, Bubby. You don't want this. Oh! Hell no! <laughs> you forget. We come as a pair, you fool. Well, I assume I need the green power before I can get whatever that is. What the? Oh, hey! That time you showed up! You little shit. I consider myself a pretty large shit, actually. I gotta ask. Why do you, why do you insult me? What did I do to you? You killed my entire extended family over the past eight episodes. We're not the same bird. Oh. But we all agree you're huh? fat. There was no need. There was no need. I was trying to work out our differences, and he just went right back to it. Pixar. Here, boy. You don't even gotta read it. I can see it. It says Pixar. Oh! The rest of the runes were hidden over the hill. That's Vinder. When? That back ain't a V, bro. That just ain't... Okay. I'll let him cook. Well, do your thing. Let's see it then. Vinder. Oh my god, what the... Look what it did! It just fucking flotated those rocks. How about that? Oh, we are there. Another runic. Storm of the Elks. Dang. That's pretty cool too, actually. I want to stick with the crows, but I'll, I'll switch back to them when I, uh... It's actually better, technically. I'll switch back to them once I get an upgrade for it. Okay, I think that's everything out here. Let's say hello to the Father, woman. Father, she is here! It is so good to see you again! Hi. I knew you weren't dead. <laughs> hello. Oh. Keep your hands off my child. Can you bring a head back to life? <laughs> I'm not sure I understand what... D Wait. Just bring it. Where did you, you get know. those? The arrows. Give them to me. Now. Clean for you. were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. I... 
believe you that's find the point any of an more, arrow. You destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. Can you give him some new ones, though? It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. Oh. I have no need for them anymore. Okay. As long as he can shoot something, I don't really now. care. What's this about a head? A literal head. Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. <laughs> he claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? Please? Do it. Take him to the table. Yeah. Hey, Malik. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's keep a mental Let's note. She doesn't like. Well. The green. Thankfully, his head hasn't toe. decayed much, and his brain is still intact. <sighs> nice clean cut. That is my job. Cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. Yeah. Now hold his head under the water and don't let go. I mean it. The old drowning technique. We gotta kill him again to revive him. That's pretty cruel. That's enough. <laughs> oh God, Jesus! It works. Why? Let Why is him. that how it works? Mamir, you there? Yes. Good. Oh. You. Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. Freya. What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. Had I known the witch in the woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Isn't that, um... Freya? The goddess Freya? Yeah. You didn't know either? Sorry. I don't know much more. When word Norse, gets out but... the free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once yes, oh. but no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you really going to lecture me about that? Real young boy. Yeah, I mean, but you can't now. expect her to not keep secrets if you're not going to tell her everything, you know. You're welcome. Okay. What did the turtle do? What did Torbal do to you? Huh? Why did you do that? We cannot trust her. Because she's a god? Or have I taught you nothing, boy? <laughs> but she's helped us a lot. She lied. Some people value the privacy. I'm not That's sure she not ever lied. Judge, she just retained when the I truth. When I require your counsel, head, I will ask. <laughs> Fair enough. Get me to Tyr's temple in the Lake of the Nine, and I'll get you to Jotunheim as promised. We know the temple. What's there? Only the last living giant in Midgard. You better <gasps> tell us the way. The world serpent? Wait, do you know how to talk to him? Indeed. He speaks an obscure tongue more ancient even than these mountains. None are left in Midgard who speak it. Except, of course, for me. You do? That's true. You wouldn't know it to look at him, but Jormungandr is a sparkling conversationalist. The giant snake speaks. Okay. You know, it's kind of crazy. I feel like this is the only franchise where I can say that this is not the first time that we've had a decapitated head uh, on our tool belt. But, you know... The cookie crumbles, I guess. Or the heads roll, something like that. The other one wasn't conscious, so at least you got that going for you, buddy. He did have a brighter eye than you. Here we all. Oh. Yeah, you, you, so you got a here. seat too. Why did Bray spin your face? No. Speak of Balder. He claims nothing harms him. Aye, Balder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Boasting of a god. Everyone has a weakness. Not him, I'm afraid. Balder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. You just said that, Mimir. Did I? Bro has what one is the voice. source of this power? Well, as I recall, it involved uh, a spell? Mimir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. Just need a moment to finish waking up. Okay. Hope he's not broken. Um, well, 
he was dead for like probably a good hour or so. Can't be that can't be that fresh. Mimir, we're in the lake. Oh, maybe. Perfect. Dorcas near the bridge. My controllers lit up like a a frosty blue, which I feel like is more fitting for Ragnarok, but Mimir, you never did tell me why Frey spit in your face. Enough. No stories. Not while on foot. Our focus is the road. I swear Completely they always start understand. stories as soon as I'm done. I'll finish later, lad. Ed, how do we speak to the serpent? There's a horn on a platform at the middle point of the bridge. Take me to it. Finally, that horn! Yeah, oh, so, yeah, maybe it was a good idea to withhold using it earlier. Good. Now put my lips to the horn. That sounds weird, but okay. How do you still have the vocal strength to do that? Jesus Christ. Oh my lord. What a beefcake. Odin had that statue made in honor of Thor, and seeing as the world serpent absolutely abhors the fat dauber, he was probably sick of looking at it. But Fair doesn't enough. that hurt? Well, he and Thor have a bit of an unpleasant history between them, or they will anyway. So I guess waking up to see it was worse than the thought of lumps of solid stone passing through his gullet. You want me to ask him? No. So it has or has not happened yet. Time. My controller is shaking every time he says something. All right, wish me luck. Do not fuck this up. Oh my god. You remember Jesus me. Christ. Why are you? Oh, no, that's not right. Eh. Uh, Mokuno Huntunku. What do you say? Of your loss, he will help you. Julius, hey, whoa, 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 nothing to be concerned about. But this what is you, a, you could sure see how it could be right pursued, perceived Listen as concerning. Now. We need two things to get us Whoa. into the land of the giants. First, we need to learn the travel rune that opens realm travel to Jotunheim. Okay. Second, we need to carve that rune into the special gateway. Okay. That one of the people we first hey, I can do this, by the way. Mr. Except Serpent, you're not special. I was able to do this. Wisdom saw to it that no ordinary anyway. chisel would do the job. Only the tip of a magical chisel opens that gate. Luckily, Magic I know chisel. where it is. It's not far. He looks kind of mad for a moment. Now that, you thought I said you were friends of Odin. You'll forgive me. I've never spoken the ancient tongue sober. That is like the opposite of what you're supposed to say, man. Jesus. Wait, look! The water's dropped even further. You can see more of the realm towers and statues. I haven't seen new places to explore along the shore. Where is this chisel? Find me a boat. And we'll go from there. Yeah, the water's mad low now. Heck yeah. So much new stuff to explore. How about we just dive in? Oh, never mind. That's a rock. Which is the one for the, the fire realm that we got, though? I want to go there, too. Jeez. Get put that out of his misery. So when we get to the boat, we can either look for that special chisel now or go exploring for a little while. I'm happy with whatever you want to do. Your happiness wasn't really in consideration, man, but... Which way to the, the input. Keep rowing towards the statues of the oarsmen. 
then thread past between them. Oh, oh. special thing. The mirror. Grab the goo. You never did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Well, she blames me in Strength large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. Oh. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won. But the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses. And for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. But a rather senseless waste of precious life. It was fun before. Wouldn't you agree, brother? Mm. Precisely. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy. A certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for oh, her? Tough luck. It was a sacrifice to protect her people, a selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Dang. This is helping me learn Norse lore a little bit, not gonna lie. This is like how Assassin's Creed taught me history a little bit. I... No! <laughs> okay. I learned my lesson, okay? I know I'm not ready. I, I, you know. But maybe I'm ready for this. Ooh. Magic thing. Hey, it's a fragment of a language site. We should look for more like this. Realm of Niflheim. Dang, you're getting all the realms. Oh my god, that's a dragon. Ah, Fafnir. I always wonder what became of him. Wait, Fafnir? Like, Fafnir's storeroom Fafnir? The fucking Very dwarf? One. But Sindri said he was a dwarf. He was, and now he's a dragon. <gasps> Funny how life works, isn't it? He's chained up. Perhaps we should keep an eye out for binding shrines oh and my free the god. poor bastard. He looks Hi, sick. Lads. How the fuck does that happen? Yeah, I'm just a dragon now, I guess. I don't know Oh my god. Hey! Fuck you! Yeah! Bring him down. Ugh. was a constant source of annoyance amongst Aesir and Vanir alike. Then why free him? Trust the recently liberated brother. No one deserves to be held captive like this. Even a greedy little dwarf come dragon. Oh shit. Yeah. you good at that. Bang. Never answered the boy's question, Head. How did this dwarf become a dragon? Well, I don't know for certain, though I'd wager his penchant for stealing magical artifacts had something to do with it. Must have stolen a trinket from the wrong How Vanir goddess. How does one turn goddess. into a fucking dragon? I wouldn't complain though, I guess. Being a dragon is much cooler than being a dwarf. What the fuck is that? Oh god. Fuck you. Get this ass. Piece him up. 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 Alright. Man, this is very, very, very ineffective. Oh! <laughs> 
Oh fuck. Oh. Jesus. Oh. How about that? Ow. God damn it. Fuck you. What is that? Get shit on. No. Oh damn, that was sick as fuck. So do those guys have a weakness that I'm not getting, or they probably get tougher as the fight goes on. So I save my uh, rage. Whoa! Bitch! <laughs> Get him out of here. Get him out. Get him out. Oh my god. No! Resurrection Stew. Take him out. Take him out. Whoa, relax. Yeah. You two make quite a formidable duo. Damn right. What do we do with that? We will show it to the dwarves. All right. I love that heavy attack. Set him Time flying. to set him free. Think he'll remember you? I don't know, lad. A lot's changed since we last crossed paths. I had legs. He was a dwarf. I feel like that's the more notable change. Oh, Christ. Oh, Christ. What's going on here? Ow. Got it, man. I, I believe in you. Hi. Well, the dragon hasn't done much for his personality. There he goes. Cool. Christ. We got one more dragon to free. Oh, and by the way, I think I forgot about you. Exosuit. Piece of shit. I remembered episode three, I think, where you mocked me. Yeah. Because I couldn't hit you. Yeah. All the way from the tower. Well, guess what, buddy? You're morbidly obese. No. You... Sure. God. Now it's in door number two. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Say they're winning? What the? I'm ready. Fuck you. Ooh, 
Look here. While we hail from Alfheim, the Light Elves make sure to watch over Midgard. I've spent most of my life here at this outpost, and I will likely die here. Hello, statue. Why do you look so breakable? Hmm? Name that. Why is it? To you. So. Breakable. False advertising is what I call that. Oh, I hear a certain dwarf. Which one, though? The blue one or the queen freak? Oh, queen I have a freak. favor to ask. Just a small favor, really. Do you remember the dagger you gave me? The dagger stabbed into the reaver's back? His own son killed him? Yeah. Oh, that I guy. haven't forgotten that one. Well, I traced it to a group of reavers that operate out of the Northree stronghold. I'd wager that's where they took their haul from Fafnir's storeroom. Along with that whetstone that I could use to help you. <laughs> Right. What can I do for you two? Another treasure oh hunt. My God. Pointless. Well, not if Sindri really can make us better equipment with that whetstone. Oh, what the Plus, stuff? The Reaver's son. He murdered his father. That is true. That is true. That is not false. Defense and vital minus strength. Ooh, give me this. That looks amazing. Give me this. Fine piece of work. If I say so. Myself. Yep. Oh my god, I want the smoldering stuff so bad. I can upgrade it? Heck yeah. Where it is good to Ooh, heck yeah. I think that's a keeper. Heavy runic attacks. Oh my god, that's the coolest thing I've ever seen. Oh, but I don't have any of that stuff. Fuck. Why do you tease me with things I can't have? Got four arrows now, hell yeah. Alright, look at the new drip. We're kind of nice with it right now. Oh, we're looking strong now. We're level four. Well, I'm assuming this is how I get to the side mission, but I want to just do story for now, to be honest. Okay, Kratos disagrees, but we're going to force his hand here. Let's get you moving. I'll definitely have to spend some time revisiting the lake because there's even more stuff now. And going to the fire realm. Maybe next episode will just be side missions because we don't have a ton of stuff to do. Love and hate are more closely intertwined than you might imagine. For instance, Odin hates the giants and they him. But Thor's own mother was the giantess Fjorgun, one of Odin's great loves. So Thor's half god and half giant? Weird. Once Fjorgun was gone, lonely ages passed okay. for Odin. And as war with the Vanir raged, I could see what he really so wanted. So Vanir and Acer don't like each other. And after no small amount of convincing, Freya agreed. For a while there, he really turned on the charm. He seemed happy. He seemed interested in making her happy. He granted her so many wishes, I can scarcely recall them all. So they married. But peace held, and I truly believed all There's had peace. worked out better than I could have planned. Okay. But Odin's true face showed itself again in the end. Uh-oh. Oh, he won Freya's trust, and she taught him some of her Vanir magic, another choice she would live to bitterly regret. Sadly, despite his wise counselor's best efforts to persuade him that peace was the only true path to stave off Ragnarok, Odin never let go of his obsession with Jotunheim. The taste of Vanir magic led him to new forms of experimentation and new levels of depravity. Cool story, bro. What the? You were taken from this realm too early. Hi. You who walks among the living. That's me. My beloved Gulvig calls to me. Who? She yearns for peace, yet her remains lie in pieces. I beg of you, make my Gulvig whole again. You what want us to Gulvig? collect her bones? Gross. Gulvig's sather magic knows no bounds. She can reunite you with those you've lost. Really? How? Boy, <laughs> I can smell your grief, child. Rest assured, her magic is Don't strong enough for that. to create bridges between life and death, if only for a short while. Boy, we are leaving. None of that bullshit. They've taken three of Sweet Gulvig's bones and spread them across the lake. Bring me her bones, child. Gulvig will reward you. That's Cap. Don't fall for that. Good. 
The special chisel is ahead past this gate. Here we go. What? Why? You wanna go, buddy? I'm better. I'm stronger. What the? What are you doing here? Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Get him. should look for those bones. Why? Didn't you hear him? We could talk to mom again. If we keep an eye out look while we... Wish, boy. I will not be distracted by this fool's errand. Sam, wasting this your time, kid. Missing. What is it? I'm glad you asked, actually. I have just the story for you. <clears throat> there was a giant once named Thamu. A very giant giant. Big boy. Who, despite his mountainous size, was without question the greatest stonemason this world had ever seen. Hephaestus? Proud Thamur hoped to one day pass his vast knowledge onto his son. But young Hrimthur had the heart of a warrior. Perhaps the father had too mm. much fear in him, or the son too little. Either way, a quarrel of theirs spiraled out of control, and the overworked stonemason bonk, struck his son. Arimthur Get ran off. off into the night. Feeling shame and regret, Bamur chased after his son. But in his emotional state, soon found himself wandering Midgard, lost and alone. Sadly, he caught the eye of the one person he didn't want to meet alone that night. So far from Who's home. that? Thor. Uh-oh. Sam? What happened next? You'll see. Oh, fuck. No. He fell in a village? Aye. Holy Thamma shit. Fell, crushed a charming place, famed for worshipping the Vanir God. Oh, you were joking about him. You always took credit for planning that one. The truth is, the sweaty claw bag just got lucky. Oh my god. Crystals up ahead. A wolver, on your mark. Oh, what? What's up, bitch? Oh, you got caught in my crossfire, buddy. Come here. Oh. Hey. Bitch. We seek a chisel. The tip of one, yes. Very, very giant chisel. That big crystal on the giant's brain looks promising. Look at these doors, man. Magically sealed, I'm afraid. Yeah, well, I figured that. <laughs> Noise. Oh, a new trick lad. Thanks. His idea. Well, obviously. It must be uncomfortable for the, the head just having to fly around everywhere and running. <laughs> but you know, I think, oh my god, look at this dude. Thor killed this guy. That's crazy. Um, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Good amount of progress. We got the head back. We're on our way uh, to getting what we need to open up the gateway to Jotunheim. I think next time we'll uh, we'll complete what's over here. And then maybe branch out, do some side missions, explore the lake a little more. Maybe visit some new realms, who knows. Uh, but we do have some XP to spend. What the hell? 15,000? I want that. Barehanded aim and press R1 to recall the axe. It's kind of niche, but only 1k. So we'll get it. Ah, this is only 1.5. Fine. We have all the axe stuff. Get a trace. 
Yeah. Nice. Oh shit, I was gonna upgrade the damn... I was gonna upgrade this. And then equip it. Whatever. I'll just use it next time. Alright. Any codexes? Fafnir. If you're reading this, go away. You don't belong here. This is my ravine. And don't touch any of my stuff on your way out. You're still here? I told you to leave. These are my treasures and you can't have them. The best stuff in, is in my storeroom anyways. You don't even think about going in there. That place is well guarded. I made sure of that. Just leave me be. I don't need you. I don't need anybody. Certainly not any of, of all these stupid sons warning me of the dangers I, uh, of greed. I only need to look in my newly acquired Vanier mirror to see what it does to my skin, but I don't care. My treasure makes me feel safe and it warms from the inside like the breath of a dragon. It lost. It reminds me of a uh, Larflees, the uh, orange lantern. And Vari's invention. Through the path lies the mines of Volandir. This, I hope that's how that's pronounced. This great endeavor was made possible by Anvari the Alchemist, son of Ivaldi, through whose ingenuity the very stone at bedrock was turned from the obstacle to mighty tool of industry. A dwarven miner's greatest fear has always been running afoul of the ancients, but through Anvari's genius they are now no more than tools in our righteous undertaking. A new age of dwarves dawned here, no mere miners of m but masters of iron whose cra greatest craft is the future itself. Okay. Oh yeah, this guy. Really strong armor, they have two swords, and are one of the toughest enemies we faced. Who are they? What do they want with us? No known weaknesses? Fafnir. Fafnir was a dwarf, one of the sons of Avaldi, according to Mimir. But he was very greedy, and his greed turned him into a dragon. It sounds ridiculous, but I saw this with my own eyes. He was a dragon. I wonder if it was painful to turn from dwarf to dragon. How long did it take? I had a bunch of questions for him, but he flew off before I could ask any. Not sure he could answer them. So we can go to Muspelheim. Just a little scared of it, not gonna lie. And we got... Collecting the bones and the family business. So all that and more next time on God of War. Uh, but that is where I got to leave this one. Next time we will um, explore the carcass of this um, giant. But until then, I must wave you. Hello.